really hot date calls me up asking me. Next we have the plank twists. I don't like the plank twists. Okay, I like this next one. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. This is the Daily Student YouTube channel and if you haven't subscribed already, do subscribe now. Now today, we have another challenge. You guys know I love my fitness challenges. I love any type of challenge. And I saw this one the other day by someone called San Vander. I hope I pronounced that right. I'll link it down below if you guys want to check out her videos. It was basically fitting in 1,000 ab exercises in one day. And yes, I know, you cannot get abs in one day. But I wanted to try it and see what difference it can really make if, for example, let's just brainstorm here. If a really hot date calls me up asking me, girl, I want to take you out on a date tonight, I want to take you out on a date tomorrow, how much can I really pull it together beforehand if I have a fancy dinner? Or if it's my last minute holiday exercise, can I really pull it together before in one day? So this is an experiment, this is a challenge, I want to see the results, like will it actually give you guys a difference? Let's get right into it and see how that goes. So I'll walk you through all the exercises that are involved within this challenge. There are 10 ab movements of which you repeat a hundred times and if you want to do this challenge those movements are a hundred Russian twists 50 on each side a hundred sit-ups a hundred ab pushes a hundred scissors a hundred toe touches a hundred mermaids a hundred plank twists a hundred side crunches right and a hundred side crunches left. Reading that out loud just really made it sink in what I'm about to do, but let's get right into the challenge. That is Russian twists done. You would think because I've done the Chloe Ting challenge, the Pamela Rife challenge and the Alexis Ren challenge, that I'd be a pro at Russian twists by now. But it's the fact that you have to keep your feet off the ground, like your stomach is literally like screaming for air. Apart from the pain, we're gonna we're gonna push on. We're gonna do sit-ups next. Sit-ups are fine, they just take a long time to do. You can't really go fully fast at it unless you're a pro. So let's just try and smash that. Oh, I'm finding it easy. I think it's because I did the Chloe Ting challenge and the other challenges. I'm finding sit-ups really easy all of a sudden. Mm. Oh my gosh, this is where it starts getting very sweaty. We have ab pushes next. I need to Google what that is because I have completely forgotten. Okay, I like this next one, it's pretty easy. We are just under halfway through. I'm exhausted, I'm so exhausted. My stomach feels like a rock. Nothing will really show here. It is feeling very tough. Next we have the plank twists. I don't like the plank twists. Your socks will make your feet slide so much. That's the only reason why they end up being so difficult. But I'm almost there. I thought I was gonna have breaks throughout the day to do this, because obviously it's a day challenge. I just wanna do it like all in one go. So guys, that is the ab challenge over. I am still out of breath. I thought I was gonna break that up throughout the day. Once I started, I was like, I need to finish this all in one sitting. But I thought I might as well show you the progress in the morning to allow it to marinate, to allow the magic to actually work. So first thing in the morning, I'm gonna show you if what I've done all today really pays off. It definitely does feel very toned. I guess if you want like stomach fat to just suck in for a bit, then it does work in that sense. But have a look in the morning and see what the magic is. So guys, that is the end of the video. I hope you have enjoyed it. So as you can see from the results just then, it just looks as if 
it's just reduced the bloating, reduced the inflammation, so my stomach has gone down because of those two things. Other than that, no, no abs, but it was kind of expected because you can't really gain abs in one day, in less than a day almost. Reduce your bloating and reduce inflammation, so it gives your stomach a smaller look effect, um, which is kind of good if you want to fit into a dress, but it's not going to give you abs. It takes a bit more to get abs than that, but it has been a fun challenge. I mean, it's always fun to try something, so if you guys want to try that, do tag me in your videos and let me know, and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye guys!